Good afternoon. Welcome today. This, uh, this is an exciting day and uh, we appreciate your coming out. It's an exciting day for the community college. It's an exciting day for the students. It's a, an exciting day for the Meyer family. It's an exciting day for the community. And it's an exciting day for me. I walked these halls 48 years ago. I know I don't look that old, but it, it, was, it was 48 years ago. And I used to complain to Steve about a year ago. I said, these, these rooms and halls look the same as they did 47 years ago. And they did. And they were lined. Mark, Mer, or, or, uh, Mark Meyer uh, also went here quite a bit later than me. But uh, we can remember these halls and just having lockers like an old high school, like our high school hallways. And the classrooms were so um, bare and old-fashioned. and. Um, it's just such a pleasure to, to see them upgraded and, um, and have this business center. So we're here to celebrate that and thank the, thank the Meyer family and uh, the, the Meyer community uh, as well. Um, I want to recognize we have at least two, we have at least three, I know, members of the Board of Trustees. So uh, Rich, Rick, and Bert. And right, four. Go ahead and wave your hand. Welcome. And I've seen uh, some members of the foundation board. I know Derek's here. Uh, Michael. Anybody else? So we welcome them. And we welcome George Hartwell. He must go to 180 of these a year. He's, <laughs> we, we, don't, we don't have a ribbon to cut. <clears throat> But we appreciate you coming, George. It's a pleasure to have you here. So, Now my pleasure is to introduce uh, the president of the college, uh, Dr. Steve Enders. And I'm grateful I can still sneak through that little space. Uh, so as David said, this is an incredibly exciting day for our college. Um, we are so fortunate to have partners and friends and that we can count on the Meyer family and the Meyer business enterprise, in fact, to be able to say they are a partner and a friend. Um, today the family is represented by Hank and Mark, who you will meet in a moment. Um, but this relationship is one that is special in many different ways. And so the Meyer family, as I've come to know them, are just good people. And as a college, we try to be good stewards and present to this community a relationship that's built on some trust, um, certainly caring, as I think about our faculty and staff and our engagement. Uh, and a high degree of integrity and ethics. And, and I would use those same words to describe Mark and Hank Meyer, quite frankly, as people. So that's just, for me, a wonderful fit and relationship. But it goes beyond that in, in what I am very proud of is the Meyer brand um, is about excellence. It's about community service. It's about integrity. It's about transparency. Uh, it's about being good stewards to the communities that they work in. And so for us to be associated with that brand is very special for the college. And um, that, in part, makes this a very special day. And then, of course, um, the Meyer Enterprise tends to hire a lot of GRCC students. And we will, we will hear from some of those students today. <laughs> and so at the end of the day, that's what this is all about. Uh, we had a great uh, construction management firm in here, Pioneer, did this project for us in a very short time frame. Uh, Mike and who else is here? Ross is here. Where are you guys? So we owe you a great uh, debt for your service to this institution. You know, this work was done in about a 
two month time span to get this first floor, this floor we're on here open, this wing, it took another 20 days or so to have that completed. But if you walk down this corridor, you will walk from 21st century education to 20th century education. Uh, our goal is to have an entire floor of 21st century education. And again, I want to thank the Meyer family. I mean, this all came about as a result of our GRCC Works Capital Campaign. And, and um, this family stepped up very early and with a very strong commitment to the campaign that has allowed us to do this now a second project uh, through their wonderful gift to the institution. And I guess that's the other piece of this that I should mention. It's, it's very helpful for folks like me that um, talked to a lot of people about partying with their money. Uh, to have Hank um, and the family, Mark, and the Meyer Corporation to make this kind of commitment to the college because it says a lot to others that are thinking about that commitment. So with that, I, uh, I have this great honor today uh, to provide the dedication and I think if we're ready, we would like to introduce all of you to the Meyer Center for Business Studies. Hank, could I ask you to step forward? Thank you, President Ender and Dave Custer and Mayor Hartwell, um, members of the Board of Trustees and friends and students of the college. Uh, my brother Mark and I, and Mark is the GRCC graduate in our family and the leadership skills he learned here helped him delegate to me the job of standing up in front of you while he, <laughs> he is, uh, presides over us from right there. Um, I did have the pleasure, as, as he did and as Dave mentioned, of walking these halls, not as a graduate, but I took a couple of classes here. In fact, I had an accounting class here that would have been in one of the rooms on this hall. And it does look very, very different today than from what I remember. Um, just very briefly, we're, Mark and I are just so pleased to be here in a moment of celebration for the college. Our company is absolutely committed to Grand Rapids and to growing in Grand Rapids. And we know we can't do that without the best possible talent. And these hallways, some of the people standing right here today are the embodiment of that and what we count on as we think ahead with our company. And so I would just like to thank Grand Rapids Community College for all that you do for this community not only for making Grand Rapids a better place, but also for providing a pathway to the future. And with that, thank you very much. And I'd like to introduce Professor Pereiro to talk about this very special place. It is our goal at the Meyer Center for Business Studies to help people in our community turn their dreams into reality. It is our goal at the Meyer Center for Business Studies to explore the possibilities of reimagining a better world. It is our goal at the Meyer Center of Business Studies to help nurture that creative spirit in every human being. From the moment students enter the Meyer Center for Business Studies, they will know that they are welcomed and that this distinctive space was designed for them. The Meyer Center for Business Studies space blends the traditions of our main building architecture with forward-thinking interior designs that are reflective of today's most successful businesses. Businesses design environments to help employees become more productive and creative. And we have done the same thing here at the Meyer Center for Business Studies. The rooms that you'll see here today have all the modern treatments, technologies that you would find the most successful business organizations. Businesses is about, business is about solving problems and creating value in the marketplace. We want to simulate as close as possible a modern business environment that would inspire problem solving and critical thinking skills in our students.
The rooms are flexible to meet the different teaching methodologies used by our distinguished faculty to challenge students and build the key fundamental understanding of business, marketing, accounting, management and leadership, law, and the free market principles of the rule of law and the right to private property and freedom to succeed. There are benefits, and they're obvious, at the Meyer Center for Business Studies, and I'll highlight four of those. The first benefit is the Meyer Center for Business Studies will ignite students' imagination. The Meyer Center is an innovative space that facilitates innovative teaching and imaginative student solutions. A second benefit, the Meyer Center for Business Studies is a visible call to excellence. The high quality of this innovative new space calls students to a higher level of work. It is a serious environment that challenges students to take their own thinking, planning, studying, and creating to a new level. At GRCC, students are challenged to develop solid work ethic and reliable analytic skills. They are reminded that they can realize their dreams if they are willing to pay the price. Creating businesses and achieving success require real endurance and well-developed critical thinking skills. In this new center, students will acquire the strategies, tactics, and tools to succeed. A third major benefit, the Meyer Center for Business Studies encourages students to remember their civic duty. The Meyer Center is a visible example of the valuable lessons taught at GRCC. Lessons like, it is not what we have, it's what we do with it. Giving starts the receiving process. Success unshared is failure. The new space will be a constant reminder to students that with their future success comes the invitation to help others give back to their communities, especially those most in need. A fourth benefit, the Meyer Center for Business Studies is a distinctive environment that will inspire and motivate students. Successful entrepreneurs are self-motivated and disciplined. They draw inspiration from other successful business creators as the current and future generations of job creators walk the halls of the Meyer Center of Business Studies, they will be continually reminded and inspired by this welcoming space and the Meyer family achievements. In conclusion, the benefits of the Meyer Center for Business Studies extend far beyond these walls. The entrepreneur and self-employed person is the economic engine that drives sustainable growth in this world. It is through their efforts and hard work the society's standard of living is raised for all. The Meyer motto of higher standards and lower prices ties perfectly with our mission at GRCC. <laughs> GRCC endeavors, endeavors. Oh, I'm in, I'm in trouble. It was nice knowing you, Hank. GRCC endeavors to provide high quality education at an affordable price, especially for those challenged economically, the poor, and for many still, this is the pathway out of poverty. I know it was for me. The new Meyer Center for Business Studies at GRCC, Hank, and to the Meyer family is a match made in heaven. And with that, all the faculty, staff, all the students like to thank you, Hank, and, the gener and for the generosity of your entrepreneurial family. And with that, we have a short video that we would like to show. It features uh, two former students at GRCC that now work at Meyer corporate offices, Catherine Casey, human resources team leader, and corporate retail operations, and Stephanie Spratling, compensation and benefits analyst. Thank you very much. God bless you. small town, um, Kent City. I used to describe my high school as the one between the apple orchard and cornfield. <laughs> and uh, moved on to Grand Rapids Community College. Actually did dual enrollment, so I completed two courses my senior year of high school. Then decided to transfer to Central Michigan. And then I just graduated recently with my master's um, MBA from Michigan State University in May. Well, I born and raised here in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Went to Grand Rapids Central High School. Um, I ended up going to GRCC. I honestly didn't think I was going to go to 
college and it wasn't really in my plan. Just took a few classes that sounded interesting and um, it was really a great stepping stone for me because it, you know, it really helped me figure out where, what I wanted to do. My biology teacher from my freshman year had actually recommended me for tutoring, so I ended up tutoring mostly algebra. Got some of the students with some learning disabilities, so they really struggled in math, and that was just a very rewarding experience. I just really got interested in um, human resources. That's what I set out to do. Actually, the tutoring experience helped me gravitate toward that as well. I really liked the, the teaching and coaching um, piece of it. It made sense to me, and I thought, you know, this is something I think I could, that I could be good at. I was really involved in the theater there. It was a great community at the college that I enjoyed being a part of. I also had the opportunity to do a few of the uh, GRCC newscasts, so that was exciting as well. As part of our summer computer camp, a special section was created just for girls. This section was designed to encourage girls to pursue any interest they may have in technology. That led me to Aquinas. My major was in communications, my minor was in theater. Going to GRCC kind of helped prepare me, like I said, and give me the confidence to move forward in that because I never felt like I was very good at school. I've been with Meyer for five years and um, it's been a great experience. And I've been um, a very big part, I would hope to say, in, in our growth and our continued growth. So I've helped open five stores and you know, I've been pretty involved in the community as well. So to hear that Meyer is continuing to give and that we're looking at Grand Rapids Community College and um, other organizations is, is not surprising. It's just who we are and what we do. I'm very proud to say that you know, we're giving to, to the college and um, it's just gonna you know, help us prepare for growth. So we have to invest in you know, young leaders because they're going to be our future leaders in our organization and it's very, very, very important. I've been at Meyer five years now. Um, always was interested in, in human resources, and a big part of human resources is communication. And communication is so key when you have 60,000 employees across five states. Getting up and speaking in front of 100 people sometimes, you know, it really what you learn in the theater and your public speaking classes and a lot of those interpersonal classes that I took at Grand Rapids Community College, yeah, that really helped. It's really exciting. I was really excited to hear that they're making this contribution, you know, to Grand Rapids Community College. They just, they do so, so many great things for the community. It's a company I'm very proud to work for. Isn't that cool, the appreciation that your employees show for your giving? I know that means a lot to you, and that's cool. It really is cool. So thank you again, Myers. Um, you've always been there. Steve mentioned our last capital campaign, GRCC It Works. Um, part of the Meyer donation went to this, so without that, this wouldn't have happened. Uh, Hank was one of our tri co not co-chairs, tri-chairs, with uh, Doug DeVos and Fred Keller and Hank. And, and I was especially appreciative of that. That was a big help uh, to me and to the foundation. So, uh, so we thank you again. Thanks for coming. Some logistics. Right, uh, right behind you there, there's some refreshments uh, if you'd like. As Steve said, if you've got time, walk down the hall because you'll see this beautiful new 21st century uh, hallway and classrooms, but it, as you keep going, you'll see last uh, what it was like when I went here, so uh, I may not go down there. I don't know. And finally, if you parked in uh, any of our ramps, see, um, where are you? Anne Marie, right here, raise your hand, or Mary, right here, and she'll give you a pass that'll get you out for free. So that's hard to resist. So thank you again, and we appreciate your coming.